guys, welcome back to Master Chef. Kidding, but kind of today. Welcome back to Keep It Real. But today you are cooking with me. during this time and I've been cooking a lot I suck in the kitchen people used to hate my food my friends hate my food everybody hates my food so I decided to learn how to cook so today I we can't we can't go out we've got to stay home stay home if you're not staying home stay home so I'm gonna cook a three-course meal that's gonna be my challenge an appetizer an entree and a dessert so I'm gonna cook with whatever I have left in my house I'm gonna be creative and think about whatever I can make in here. So first thing first, put your hat up. My hair is too pretty to be in food. Get my apron. I actually won this in a store of friends. Who knows me knows that I love friends. It's my one of my favorite shows. Never wore it before, so I'm wearing just for you guys. Oh, I actually have a lot of stuff. I'm gonna do something with cheese, obviously. I'm already getting this. Oh, I'm gonna make pastel. Who doesn't know, this is a Brazilian thing. It is one of my favorite things. It's deep fried. It's basically a dough, and then you can put anything you want inside. So I just put this and this in cheese and close it up. It's like a Brazilian quesadilla. Cauliflower. I can make, I make everything with cauliflower because it's pretty much the only vegetable that I like. Um, and I have ground beef. So I'm gonna make, actually, this is like all Brazilian stuff that I'm making today. I'm gonna make a uh, escondidinho, which is pretty much uh, mashed potatoes, a layer of mashed potatoes and ground beef and another layer of mashed potatoes. But we're all being healthy here, so I'm doing mashed cauliflower. I need more stuff. <laughs> there we go. Am I missing something? Dessert. Um, cake! Because it's quarantine and we deserve. We're already being healthy. We're already fine. We can eat some cake in the end of it. For this conigino, well, we need a cauliflower, a full cauliflower, cream cheese, ground beef, tomato basil or tomato sauce of whatever you like, and garlic and onions. So for the pastel, you can get the dough in any sto Brazilian store or Chinese store. It's pretty much as a wonton crust, so that's all you need, and cheese. Whatever type of cheese you want, whatever ingredients you want to put in, uh, ground beef is always good, uh, some shrimp or whatever you like. already pretty much ready so we follow the instructions and all that we need is butter and eggs so I'm gonna start making the pastel so pretty much all you need is a fork and a cutting board Let's put the dough here Let's see this one is already broken but no problem then add it up to cheese How many cheese you want? If you want extra cheese, go for it, because that's what I'm going for. It. That's where we need the fork. Go around. So you make sure you gotta go all the way to make sure it close. So when it's fried, when you go fry it or put it in the air fryer, you make sure the cheese doesn't go all over the thing. You can make the pastel with olive oil, uh, with olive oil, not with any oil, and then you can deep fry. But if you want to make a healthy option, that's how I'm doing. I'm putting my air fryer. And honestly, in 10 minutes, it's ready. So now we're gonna do the entree, which is gonna be this conjugate. It's made up with uh, mashed potatoes, but we're making it with this beautiful cauliflower. I already put the, the water to boil because we're gonna boil this and let's cook 
cut it, the cauliflower. You need all the flour out. Cooking is practice. You get better and better every time. Shit, this pastel is already smelling really good. I'm so hungry. I was not planning on doing that, so the ground beef is already frozen. So let's warm it up in the microwave. I hope it's not gonna ruin it. I'm gonna put 30 seconds. So I'm gonna start now the, to record the scongigio. So first I boil, uh, I'm gonna put, boil the water. As soon as it's ready, I already have it cut it off here. Just put it in, and then after I'm gonna cook the ground beef, which all you need is garlic, um, onion, butter, and the meat. Cauliflower is almost done. I'm, wait I'm waiting for it to be re really soft because we're gonna smash. And I'm just adding up um, some tomato sauce while the meats get fully cooked. The pastel is already ready. I can smell it. I wanna eat it so bad. Now, nah, Lucas. Yeah. We're hungry here. Cauliflower is ready. The challenge is not to drop this. Ugh. So now we put it back because we're gonna. Mash that bumper. So all you gotta do is just add garlic. I love garlic, so I'm gonna add a lot. And I add cream cheese. Now it's all ready. We need to put in this in any pan. I already preheat the oven. I usually put it for 350 Fahrenheit. It's ready for us. So what you wanna do is put one layer of cauliflower or mashed potato, or whatever you did. Then a layer with the ground beef, and another layer to top it off like a cake. Let's top it off with some cheese. Ready to suffer. Cake o'clock. Let's make some cake. This cake is butter cake. This is, apparently it's easy. All I need to do is add eggs, water, and this powder in the butter. They said to mash this for two minutes in high speed. They're ready. They're very crispy. It's ready. Are you excited, Lucas? Yeah. Yes. Try. Let's try. With me, I can take you down for a ride. I take you around my life. Let's try. This is not very good. I need more cheese. I'm not gonna finish this. It's not good. Well, let's try the entree, see if that... Because I do with the cauliflower, it's supposed to be like this. Very hard to get it because the cauliflower really is a lot of water. Mm. It's good. Lucas, did you like it? Yeah, for sure. It was good? It was awesome, yeah. Okay, cool. And let's have some dessert. Let's try this. Mm. It's really good. I think we're just missing ice cream. I hope you guys liked it. I hope your quarantine is not as crazy. And um, thank you for cooking with me. Maybe I'll cook one more time this quarantine. I don't know. But let me know what you think. If you have any recipes that I should try it, let me know, comment here. If you haven't watched my vlog from quarantine, the link is on the description. Like, share, subscribe, and comment. Bye, and let's keep it real.